Attack once it gives chase. How's this? Get on! No escape! into a hellion all of a sudden. What luck. Quite strange. I hope it's just a coincidence. Could it be I'm attracting them because they know I can see them? Who can say? It's too early to tell. Watch for the pauses between attacks. It's amazing how they can move without arms and legs. Couldn't have been a coincidence. They're attracted to us somehow. Look, there's the lake. And there's a huge city. Let's go check it out. Oh, 
focus, guys! What's that? Check out that view! Even the air seems different somehow. Definitely a change from Gramps' blessed domain. Alicia said the world below is full of malevolence. Can you feel it at all? I don't get that impression, personally. Me neither. I mean, it's so pastoral. Well, don't judge a book by its cover, as they say. But for now, at least we get a nice view. It's your first time here too, isn't it? What do you say? Are you pumped? Pumped? Well, mildly inflated, at least. I really feel like I'm actually in another world. It's great to have a field trip and all, but try not to get us lost, please. <laughs> we'll be just fine. I got us a map. Oh, you mean the one that's in the Celestial Record? It's kind of old, though. I'll probably need to redraw parts of it as we go along. Some kind of trouble? Looks like it. The cart stopped. caravan of merchants. I'm Agil, the captain. She's Rose. Nice to meet you. I'm Saray. Nice to meet you, too. You finally learned how not to be a creeper. Shut it. Oh, hey. So if you're a traveling caravan, where are you traveling to? <laughs> We're going all over the world. Wow. We're protected by a free trade treaty, meaning we have a free pass to pretty much go anywhere we please. Sure, we get asked to smuggle all sorts of crap, but for us, trust is first and foremost. Dishonorable trade is fine for dishonorable people, but we do things our own way. And we're damn proud of it. 
This must be the famed capitalism of humans. Sure seems that way. Yeah. We're planning to stay in Lady Lake for a while. If you need anything, just give us a holler. Yeah. We will. Thanks. Though they really ought to focus on their cart before drumming up business. <laughs> knife you got there. Think you could part with it for a thousand gold? Aw, too bad. Let me know if you change your mind. Oh wow, that's some knife you got there. Think you could part with it for a thousand gold? Then we have a deal. Pleasure doing business with you. Thanks a bunch. Let me know if there's anything else. Saray, I heard Princess Alicia came through here when she got back to the capital. I would have loved to see the so-called Princess Knight for myself. Princess Alicia, huh? Phew. Sounds like she made it back safe. Glad to hear that Fox Freak didn't catch up to her. But still, to think that she was royalty. No kidding, a straight up princess? A princess, a knight, and she explores ruins on the side? How'd she wind up with that gig? Won't know until we ask her. That's true. Besides, Foxy Loxy might be in town waiting for a chance to get at her. Yeah, we've gotta let her know. Entry paperwork? Sure. Take care of it now, and I'll let you in just as soon as that cart's fixed. All right. I'll be right on it. Hmm. Hey, everyone. Sorry about the hassle. Well, that was well timed. Welcome to Lady Lake. what Lady Lake is like. I can't believe it! Oh, so this is how humans live. Don't they find it overwhelming? Wow. Gosh, you'd think so. Just remember, this isn't a sightseeing trip. The real question is, do we try to find Alicia first, or look for the Fox Man? So, let's have a look around town for now. Good call. Let's gather information. Son, how about these duds? Made from real silk. My old lady will swap me for it, but they're yours for just 860 gold. Oh, is that cheap? Saray, behind him. Uh, 
Should we give it what for? And have everyone think you're attacking the street vendor? You want to tour the inside of a human jail cell? To everyone else, he looks just like an ordinary human. Oh, yeah. Understand now, child? No matter how tough things get, stealing is stealing. Shut up, old man. You smell like farts. And stay down! Can't even swing a fist right. That's different. Indeed. We'd best not get involved. This place was in the Celestial Record. Huh? What the hell you want now? Whoa. What, you got a problem? Oh, hey, mister. You smell like you'd be mighty tasty. Hey, let's get out of here. Dog. He's here. No mistake, that's the Fox Man. After him. So Alicia really is the Fox Man's target. Looks like it. He probably retreated for now because of the commotion.
have thought that he would be this fast. The dog's still chasing him. We can't let him get away. It's safe. Looks like he cornered it. Are you ready? Of course. Your chicken hunting days are over, Fox. So, you're really that eager to die, are you? Stronger than I remember. When we fought him back in Elysia, he must have been weakened by Gramps' blessing. I'll burn you to cinders! Take that! <laughs> Miklio! <laughs> oh, I'm going to enjoy this. A fitting end for worms who dare to wriggle at a god! I swear, I wasn't... Quiet. Who... Who are you? We won't warn you again. Be silent. Have you forgotten our code, Lunar? You're all out of second chances. Understood? Go. The assassination order was a mistake. Princess Alicia will no longer be our target. You expect me to believe that? We have our honor. Stay. The princess's enemies are legion. For those who wish to remove her, assassination is but one option among many. You have bigger worries than who we are or what we do. I suggest you hurry to the pedestal where the sacred blade is kept. Why are you telling me this? Honor. So, I guess I should be thanking you for saving us. Hmm. Hey, are you alright? What? What in the world? Looks like we were saved by an assassin's guild. By a what? They were after Alicia by mistake or something. They took that fox guy away with them. But more than that, it looks like Alicia's not out of danger yet. Looks like? What's going on? Hey. I don't get it any more than you do. Let's just hurry to that pedestal. <laughs> 